All right. And now I'm going to go demount that. And the music's going to cut in right about now. So this was actually one of the Zog, John Zhang, I believe, one one three mm, mm, yeah. But we ended up doing more for his photos as well. So um, really cool guy. He actually shared this painting and done. Um, yeah, this was like when I was first starting to understand painting. So uh, I can do a more detailed thing on that one later on, but. I just thought it'd be sick to do that on video for you guys. Now I'm going to roll this thing up. Make sure all the staples are out of the sides. Also, it's really easy to store too. So you want to do a lot of big paintings, which is what I love to do. I just you melt them and then I roll them up. I just don't want it to get, you know, scratched or whatever, so that's why I'm taking them out. I mean, you could leave it in, but then you got a risk of damaging it. I'm go over to my buddy's place. A couple friends' houses actually today. We'll see if they both. He said he was moving, so I was like, bro, I can just roll this up for you. I think he's going to Florida or something like that. I would love to go there. Kind of got glued together a little bit there. Shoot. Gotta, gotta be pretty careful with that. Now I'm gonna go drop this off over there, so. Yeah, it's gonna be sick. Yo, what's up guys? So uh, I made it back to uh, Kevin's place here. Quite the entrance coming in with all the rocks <laughs> and crap, yeah. Suck pretty bad, but uh, this is his uh, SRT4. Super sick. Very dirty. It's not that bad. It's been sitting here for two months. Dude, this thing is so sick, man. Oh, that fitment's so good. So you got these, oh man, I just met a guy, he told me exactly what these are called, but I've forgotten, forgotten the to name To be honest, them. I can't remember what they're actually called. My buddy, uh... It was like two videos ago. Yeah. And... He made, he makes them, he just like stamped them quick. Mm -hmm. They're just like, they're cheap, they're like for the Evos, you can get them really nice. But these ones are just... It's on a Subaru, yeah. I, yeah, Subaru so Evos, you can get them, like, they're really nice. You can get them like... It's something to cool down the inside of the car, because yeah. it's so hot, yeah. whatever. Because yeah. like, when I'm on the drag strip, and it's like 100 degrees outside, mm -hmm. And on the drag strip, you can't run your AC. Well, this car doesn't mm -hmm. have AC. I took it out. But you can't roll your windows down either. Dude, that's so, so cool. I want that on mine. But the window would suck, though. Well, you, you just can you pop, pop them out? Them out. Yep. You just roll the window, cool. pop them out. That's interesting with, like, the feeling of it. Yeah, it's just like But, a yeah, this thing is awesome, man. Lots of carbon fiber. I love the carbon fiber. That's sweet. And then you got the 
It's chrome tips coming out. No yeah. blasters though. No, it's, it's pretty loud, but no blast life. No, no <laughs> blast life. You got the Miata though, right? Yep. It's so super sick too. The Miata was mostly built as like a road course car. Oh, sweet. That um, I know nothing about yet. Yeah, but. just got five point harness, um, cheap wheel. I got a Sparkle wheel upstairs for it, but Yo, it's got a roll bar. That's um, super, man. It's got the harnesses look sick. Yeah, I got uh, coilovers and pretty much all suspension stuff. I haven't, I'm doing. <clears throat> I haven't seen this car yet, so yeah. Yeah, but I uh, just came by to drop off the fading for him. Yeah. So we had uh, some people yelling next door. <laughs> it's pretty good, but yeah. I mean they calmed down. So yeah, no, this is super cool. I just had to do a video on his car because it's. I just wish I could hear it start up, man. I bet it sounds good. I have my key. Oh, do yeah, you really? Can grab oh, it real quick. Dude. Sick, bro. Yo, man, this thing is so sick. Oh, and he's got the the bug eyes going on and everything. This is so cool. Oh, yo, you gonna start it up? Yep, I'm in my socks. Alright, I'm gonna shoot. I'm, I'm excited to hear this. Just sitting for a while. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. It's gonna sound good. Shut it off right away. <laughs> Isn't that hard on it or no? No, it's fine. I'm not too worried about it. This thing's seen probably 100 to 200 track passes. Yeah. So, I mean, it's seen worse than Yo, just shutting so down sick. after revving it. Gotta represent, man. That's actually Clinton. Yeah, I know. I, I recognize the sticker. It's yeah. like, no way. Yeah. And then the original. And it matches your car, too. Four doors from more horse. Got that nice leftover order from the car. Yeah, no cat. So. Yeah, dude. I need to get that. Yeah, having no cat, I love it. I don't know, maybe that'll be the next thing down the line, so... But these lights though are sick too. So this thing here... The turbo's not in it yet, but I've been pretty much rebuilding the whole engine. That's cool. Uh, refreshing everything. All new, Every pretty much every bolt, gasket, seal's been replaced. Mm -hmm. New clutch, new rear end, new drive shaft, new axles. Uh, I got a new radiator coming for it. Yeah. Uh, new ECU. Mm -hmm. But it should be about two, 230, like 220 to 250 horse. That's really cool. From 70 horse? From 70, that's a lot. It's almost 200 horsepower increase. That's sick, that's, man. It's gonna move, but... I don't think I've seen the one underneath your uh, SRT4, though, or not, but... That's cool, that's really cool, dude. Yeah. It's nothing really special under the SRT4, it's... Like, well, sure, I'm sure it's beautiful, though, compared so, to my oh, car. It's, it's dirty. Mm-hmm. Like I said, she's been sitting for a while. Yeah. It needs an overall cleaning. Oh, yo, that's tight. It's all dusty, but definitely needs a good power washing. It's a 50 trim turbo. Mm -hmm. yeah, custom intake. Nothing I, nothing I know. <laughs> yeah, battery delete. Okay. Custom fuel system, so. Um, battery delete? Yeah, put the battery in the back. Oh, no yeah, way. Yeah. So this is my uh, fuel line. That's a fucking monster line. Dude, that's sweet, yeah, man. You see that line that's hanging on the wall there? Yeah. It's a factory line. Okay. So from that to this. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's super. So this is a Dash 8, I believe. And a Dash 6 return that goes, Dude. runs the excess fuel back to the tank. Nothing I know, but it's like you're talking to them, like people that were watching this they probably know what's I'm up. Sure, yeah. I'm sure people that watch probably know. That's so cool, man. That's a big yeah. cone for your, well, my cone's a little bit bigger. <laughs> but I mean, that's just a big, uh, I can't remember the yeah, pipe or whatever. Yeah, for, yeah. The pipe, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a four inch pipe, so. That's but sweet. But I've had this turbo in this car for 
12 years. I've owned the car for 14 years. Mm -hmm. I've had it in the car for 12 years. That's so cool. And man. I just started burning oil in the turbo. So, yeah, yeah. So it's gonna be replaced. I haven't seen. I'm not, I haven't seen this yet. So I was pretty stoked to yeah. see it. Yeah. I have a uh, carbon fiber crosshairs for the uh, for the front bumper. I love all the carbon fiber. Yeah. So it looks so cool, man. This goes on the front front bumper, mm -hmm. but I just gotta put it back on. Oh, sweet. So it just adds a little more carbon fiber sweet. to it. Yeah, no, that looks cool. d too. Yeah, you can like unroll it if you want to. Yeah. And the, these are your other set of wheels you have this too. Is for, this saw, is for yeah. the uh, for the Miata. That's cool. So the blue and the white. Nice, dude. Yeah. Probably, yeah, man. I'll be putting that on probably sometime this week. Yeah, no, but that looks pretty cool actually. Like team mounted or whatever. So. All right, so oh. we're gonna do a reveal here. We can just throw it on top on the hood of the Miata. Are you sure? Yeah. Got there. So he's been working on this for a couple weeks now, with his ass off. So we'll see if I can unroll the whole thing. Uh, I can't even focus on it. Looks pretty tight. It's a little wrinkly though, because it's it's not stretched right now, but it's okay. So he shot this and then I just kinda went through and designed it a little bit. Had a lot of fun with that. So now it's off to a good home. So more of his photos to come. Yeah, I, I definitely I've taken uh, a bunch of really good photos lately. So mm -hmm. uh, there's a there's like I saw that that show you that one that yellow that yeah that two forty yeah, flipped it. Ripping off, but, yeah. Um, but dude, this this painting is fucking amazing. Dude, thank you, I, man. I love it. Yeah, so it's weird because when I when I de-stretched it, it's kind of. Interesting, because it's like, you can see the black from where the, you know, the port of the canvas was. Yeah. So. Yeah, when I bring it in, they'll, they'll know exactly. Uh, I left the bottom one white, because I was like, I don't think anyone's going to yeah. be peeping down there. It's not a big deal. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. It's, 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 a, it took a while, man. Yeah, it's. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. It kind of sucks that it's kind of, kind of wrinkled a bit from being rolled up, but I mean. But, yeah, once they, once they put it back on and stretch it, it'll be fine. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Yep, but yeah. it's going off to Kevin now. So. Dude, that's so sick. Yeah, I'm glad you like it, man. Yeah, dude, I appreciate it, man. Yeah, man. Like I said, we're going to be doing some uh, some videos and photos of his car, so. Yeah. Um, probably do like a photo set. Hey, maybe you'll paint your own car. Dude, people have been telling me, I don't me, think man. you've done it yet, have you? I don't know. So, and maybe paint his own car. Yeah, dude, that'd be pretty wild, though. It looks pretty sick. Yeah. Maybe I'll get some killer shots. So, we'll probably do that soon, I think. The rest of August are pretty busy, but maybe towards the end of August. I come back from California the 26th, so okay. th after that, I'm done. It's just almost easier to like just hold it like this, and I can go. don't have to worry about yeah. like the camera and being you on. Just cut and, yeah, you know, paste cut together, and yeah. So, but yeah, so I mean, this has been a really cool experience and a really cool video, and I hope you guys like it. Um, I'll put all of Caleb's information down below so you guys can check him out. Definitely go follow his Instagram, and you give him Facebook as well. And yeah. Snapchat. This boy's like the master of Snapchat. Snapchat's more than anybody I know, and it's entertaining. So that's all, that's all I do. Yeah, no yeah. kidding. If you want to follow, I'll put it down below. But I uh, hope you guys enjoy this video. It's really cool. And uh, that's pretty much it.